So, interesting thing that I was thinking about is you're underground, so there's no fresh air coming down here, but they light torches everywhere, which burns up the oxygen in the air. You know, I, I think they took that into consideration. <coughs> I think- Look at that, Ren. Excuse me. Could this be Tighedron? Dark spawn all over it. You can see their torches. We're getting close to something. Aye. The fight of our lives. They have specially designed venting systems so that when the heat in the air is taken up, yeah. it comes in from the top. And also, look at all this air. I mean, look at all this, like, area and stuff. Yeah. So they have I'm, torches everywhere, but also... But I mean, in, like, it's so, but some of the areas are not nearly this expansive. Yeah, they have special aerating systems. Mm-hmm. Like, where, um, you know how, like, hot air and everything and all that stuff? Yes. They have, yeah, you know what I'm saying. Hot air rises, cold air goes down. They have it so the hot air goes out one way, mm -hmm. and then some cooler air is coming in through another ventilation system from the surface. Mm -hmm. That's how they have designed. Mine! Mine! There's no reason why it should be mine, but it's mine, even though this is your ancient relics. <laughs> <coughs> What's that? This is an ancient relic? Oh, mine. Mine. But we just asked for you to help us? No, nope, mine. Sorry. Ready? Let's go on to whatever's happening next, AJ? Oh, yeah. Oh. Check out those uh, graphics. Whatever that was. <laughs> Keep your mouth closed when fighting Darkspawn. Their blood's poison. Well, you don't want to accidentally become a great warrior. Appreciate the advice. Yeah, I feel of like course that's... it's poison. Oh, I missed my chance. Oh, just gotta stare at him awkwardly. Well, the other things were kind of. I like how they actually let you ride the elevator to like look at all the stuff, you know. It's very Mass Effect One esque. Yeah. Well, that's different though because you're in an elevator and you can't see anything. You can sometimes see things sometimes. in the elevators. But you get to listen to your companions talk. And everyone's like, why are these elevators so long? I don't want to be in the elevator. I'm like, it's a cut. It's a loading screen that they saved so that you don't have to look at a loading screen. They made a cool loading screen for you. And Lost now we just have loading screens. Ones. She fell down a hole. Found her three days later. He loves this story. She spent a whole day telling us all the strange things she saw while lost. A golden longboat floating in the air. Packs of hairless children hunting nugs. A giant skeleton on a throne. Was it true? <laughs> Never found out. She woke up the next day. Couldn't remember any of it. Oh man. What if it's a titan waking up? That'd be yeah. cool. Cool and kind of horrible, but also cool, so it's like, you know. Whoa. Uh. Great. Awesome. See, this is why you have to always be having shit. This is why we can't have nice things. Well, in Dragon Age, no matter what, you have to burn the bodies of everybody. You can't just have them be whatever just be a corpse and like bury them because they automatically turn into zombies because the spirits are always like flying around being like yeah 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 what's this a body what's Love this a, an empty vessel let me add let me add it and like uh the reason why cassandra is so well not the reason why but she was given to her uncle who was a crypt keeper that's the word i, I can't remember exactly what he was but where she's a from, crypt keeper. where she's from, they uh, they don't burn the bodies. They keep them inside crypts and then just let them be whatever. Let them be animated. Yeah. Oh. And they're supposed to like take care of it and everything. It's it's oh. kind of weird. It's kind of weird. Yeah. Ah. Uh, have a look at this. Have a look at what? What am I looking at? Oh. I have yet to find any bloodstained gears. I wonder if it's in the loot. 
So, more bloodstained things. Now, hopefully we find some in the end and then we can come back, or maybe I'm missing something important and then everyone in the comments is going, Mari, you're missing the thing! With All the, the stocks. You, this is an incomplete let's play. Oh wait, ancient gear. Yeah. Perfect. So we can maybe open up one of these. I hope it's nothing but uh, loot because I would really hate for this let's play to like not be as good as it possibly could be. I would feel really bad. I I've heard encouraging things about your progress, Topatai. That you're bringing order to the chaos. That's what they tell me. We could use that down here. I don't think they'd have us come back through, though. Well, more for like uh, extra playing on your own time. You know oh, what I mean? I see. Keep your guard up. They'll use your tongue as jewelry. Ugh. I'll remember that. Man, I love how they make it feel so huge. Yeah. I'm a little aw awestruck by it. It just looks really cool. Especially how they have you start all the way up there. And they don't make it take forever to do it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Where you're like, all right, everybody, right, I get it. It's huge. Really big. So now we have all kinds of gears that we need to collect and they get really frustrated about. Love it, great game. Love it, great game design. No, just kidding. So they're everywhere. Oh. What about this? Yeah. Okay. I love how the gears don't show up on the- uh, Wait, 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 you just passed by something at the corner there. There. Oh, thanks. So now we got three of those, so if you see a door for Scorched, we're in on it. Man, you guys are not good at paying attention. They're just totally sleeping at their post. <laughs> yeah. Hey, so, uh, you've been born to kill and stuff, but it was, uh, what are you guys, what are you doing tonight? Oh, I don't know, just, just probably watch the game, have a few beers and chicken wings, you know. All yes. right, nice eyes, Stacy. Perfect. Five. What? Fuck. Oh, come <laughs> on. Five. Uh. All right, keep your eyes open. That just blasted my butt off. Dang it, Bioware. Oh, I see one. Oh. Excuse me, spiders. I only need one more. I'll just walk up. Oh, oh there it is! Alright, that didn't take forever at all! Woohoo! Wow! This is why I need Stacy around, because Stacy, I'm like concentrating on like, I wonder what the deep meaning of the spiders are. And Stacy's like, the gear's right there. <laughs> Yeah, but, but Stacy, remember the great spider king of the ancient... You passed by another one. It's right there. <laughs> of the ancient insect wars, and you're like, <laughs> shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> no, this thousand year ever warm, Stacy. <laughs> the creator provides tools, burning wheels, lower grate, 
Lower gates. I break the lines. Forget this broken sigil. Forge the broken si- si- Forge sigil. Forge the broken sigil. Lock the... Lock the way behind, claws raking the door, scatter all the keys. What trails my steps? It does not matter. There's only forward. Whoa. Whoa. Is this an Everfire or something? Or is it just started now? You know, like those fires that just last forever because it's on top of like fuel or something? Yeah. Hey, dude, chill out. Oh, I just got murdered. Wow. Oh, that oh, shriek no. is fucking us up. Wow. All right, it's time to drop some bombs. I'm trying to, man. I'm trying to drop all the bombs. It's just like these shrieks. I wonder if their design is based off of, uh, what's Zelda's alter ego? Sheik? Sheiks. They kind of look like Sheik, right? A um, little bit. You know what they remind me of? Uh, those monsters, those, like, portal monsters from DMC. Oh, right. Because they have that kind of, like, dance graceful thing to them, but they fuck you up. Man, this DLC is kind of hard. I'm really glad that we played all the other DLCs with this because if you didn't, you're totally boned. Yeah. Oh, it's a dark spawn nest? Oh god, is this Yeah, I don't want to know about that. I don't want to see a brood mother at all. You're fine, Cassandra. I was just about to say the same thing. I was like, nah, you're fine. Dark spawn waves. Fucking great. They're like, what's that? You guys missed the dark spawn? Have all the dark spawn. Fuck. All the dark spawn ever. Most people were sick of the dark spawn, actually, guys. Come on. Oh, good. Two waves down, three to go. Great, perfect. This is sort of okay, I guess. Can you fall off the side? Yes, I can, so let's oh. not trust it. Aww. <laughs> like, come on, Mari, just jump. Come on. We're only halfway through this really long objective. Kill yourself. <laughs> I just wanted to see what would happen. I just wanted to see what happens when I'm an element of chaos. <laughs> Mari, you know better. Look how cool I look right now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Explosions Look at everywhere! That. Whoa. Like, stop looking at yourself and help us fight. Korra's like, yeah, I killed all the dragons. <coughs> no big deal. They're like, we were there too. Nah, nah, nah. It was me. Nah. One of them, like, talked to me. We're, like, totally tight. And then I killed it. And it was so awesome. Yeah, he was like, yeah, I want to be friends. I think you're so cool. And I was like, yeah, maybe not. And then I killed him. Because I'm, like, way cooler than, like, stuff like that, man. <sighs> no, 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 you're, so there's, like, the dark spawn waves, there's the door, they're all, like, different, whoa, whoa, whoa that would have been bad. So, I think if you keep going, um, down, <laughs> down this way, maybe, not there, straight through. Oh, okay. I didn't see this before. Nice yeah. catch. She's 
shit's going crazy. Look at Cassandra's face. She's getting wrecked. <laughs> She's like, I got it though. It's fine. Don't worry about it. Whoa, did you just knock it off the thing? I guess. That's fantastic. <laughs> I'm sure you can like float back or something. All right, we haven't even gotten to the ogres yet. Fuck. I think this is like <coughs> a part of the DLC where you can, uh, so like reclaim the taig. So like this is their nest. Yeah. So oh. So we're like claim taking it back from them, which is why there's all like this. Th it's like a specific area. I wonder if this DLC is kind of like each area is its own separate part. And basically they're like, okay, so we're gonna have you fight like a hundred dark spawn per area. <laughs> Your job is to clear the deep roads entirely, just you. Yeah, you, do you do everything. <laughs> I, I wonder how grateful the dwarves will be once they get this back, though. Yeah. That'll give us some serious, uh... Street cred with the dwarves. With the, with the Orgrimmar and everything, because so far we don't really have a lot of pull with Orgrimmar. We have everything with the with the humans and, I don't know, some of the elves, I guess. They were like, yeah, okay, like, I mean, thanks. They're like, yeah, you're cool, I guess, but does the rock, like, speak to you? I didn't think so. <laughs> I mean, you're okay. <coughs> you're like kind of okay, I guess, for someone who saw the sky. <laughs> <laughs> who even wants to see that shit anyway? Not me. out of control. Yeah. Holy oh. fuck! Oh, I'm just God. getting wrecked! I'm just getting wrecked. Completely out of fucking control. Barrick, fucking move out of the giant fire thing. Jesus Christ. I know, you see him just like chilling there. <laughs> he was like, no, 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 this seems okay. Right above his head. And he's he was like, like standing and enveloping fire, and he was like, no, no, this seems okay. The fuck ever. I don't give a shit.
Oh, yes, he's dead. Okay. Wow. Ugh. Fuck. Like, seriously, fuck. Yeah. And watch as, like, we die on this shit. No. Bye. <laughs> Supply cash. Give that shit to me. Let's get out of here, man. Wow. That was crazy. What? All that for... We reclaim the shit. Yay. <coughs> All right, now we get to have another camp. <sighs> we reclaim the shit. We that was like on the same level as a as fighting a dragon. Yeah. That took just as long as fighting a dragon. Shape Revolta, can I get a thank you? Yeah, dude. Can can you say thanks at all? Anyway, at all. Oh, here we go. That's the last of those darkspawn. Legion's in your debt, Inquisitor. Hey, Look at this, Ren. It's ancient. Maybe a thousand years old. Any idea who built it or why? This tig is on top of a lyrium mine. According to the memories, the mine was destroyed by some unexplained disaster. The miners must have used this lift to reach the lower levels. But we're not using it, right? <laughs> if there oh, is a titan causing it. earthquakes, it's down there. I found this book with the emissary. The pages are mostly ruined, but a few are readable. See this line? I awoke to the singing stone. Our kingdom trembled at the titan's hymn. Oh my god, it is a titan! Yeah! Oh, what if it's a titan? Ooh, that would be a fucking ooh, huge... Ooh, ah! No, but like uh, they called them like the pillars of the world or something because they were so huge. Mm -hmm. So if this is Titan waking up, this is something so big. It's like the as big as a continent. Yeah, that's how big it is. How is it under? What's gonna happen to everything? You're fucked. That means we have to fight it and kill it so we can keep eating it. <laughs> keep eating it? <laughs> well, that <coughs> that's what. <coughs> excuse me. That's what Templars do. They eat it. They eat the lyrium, kind of, sort of. Oh, okay, so we are saying that the titan is lyrium? This is my, not my theory, but this is an overall theory within the fandom. Yeah. Not my theory. That reference to Singing Stone. I've been told that raw lyrium has a sound. A hum. The mining cast follows it to find lyrium veins. They say it's the stone calling to them. Perhaps it wasn't chance that the Quakes destroyed Lyrium mines. <gasps> mm. They're like, hey, quit it. Yeah. Stop. It hurts. Is it possible the Darkspawn or their emissary could also hear the song? The stone would never call to those vile things. But that doesn't mean they can't hear her. Darkspawn live and die by the blight. They don't care for much else. I didn't realize you knew so much about Darkspawn motives. Honey. Not everything's a mystery, Volta. Some things are exactly as they appear. And some things are not. Well, I wouldn't be surprised if the calling is the same for the Lyrium to the Blight. I mean, they both seem to be linked. And then in um, one of the back masks in the Well of Sorrow says, Mithal speaks the calling. And I'm like, girl, why are you in everything? Mm -hmm. Why are you doing all of it? How do we... If oh, similar quakes shit. happened then, the people who lived here may have found a way to stop them. I see no solution in the text, but it's practically dust. We're lucky any words survived. <laughs> Half a poem. Just what we needed. Perhaps this will change your mind. Look here. It's the royal seal of Orsic Garal. King Orsic Garal? That book belonged to a paragon? Maybe you are onto something, Volta. Well, why of didn't you say that before? Of course you take a dead man's word over mine. Always the traditionalist. Hey, challenging tradition lost you a cushy position in Orzammar. Hey man, you're the one who didn't believe- Why didn't you say it would belong to a paragon before? And why don't you believe her when she tells you shit? Because couples miscommunicate all the time. Maybe they're just like, yeah, okay, true. Like in real Does life. Does a king's book mean that much to you, Ren? Paragons are the best of our people. They don't hand that title out to just anyone. Not even a king. 
Knowing it was Garal's book from the start would have saved us an argument. As if you'd ever avoid an argument. They're totally dating. Yeah, okay. Everything that they say is just like, oh, you would think that, wouldn't you? You <laughs> always do. Oh, yes, that's great. Half a poem. Exactly what we needed, Volta. It's like, <laughs> okay, guys, we get it. <laughs> this I sounds personal. I see what this is here. Look at them. Should we say this sounds personal? <laughs> yeah. Volta standing within the shape it is her business. Not mine or yours, Ren. My apologies, Volta. I forgot my place. Yeah, you did. As did I. You deserve an explanation, Inquisitor. When my been superiors boning. ordered oh. me to remove an official record from the memories, I declined. We decided it would be best if I served the Shaper it here, finding history instead of recording it. Oh, dang. <coughs> we decided, quote unquote. Yeah. We decided that record Sorry. must have been important Sorry. to risk your position over it. It was trivial, actually. A childhood friend of King Balin had ancestral ties to the Carta. But the truth is the truth, no matter how political it may be. Dang. The Shaperit can erase official records. On the memories permanent? Sometimes erasing records is standard procedure. If a dwarf becomes castless, they're struck from the memories. But I was asked to change a fact that someone important merely found inconvenient. Oh. Mm. Were the Titans records? If the Shaperit is willing to erase memories, what would prevent them from covering up the existence of Titans? Why would they do that? Because someone in power demanded it. And I... because the Titans were like, hey, quit eating me, and everyone's like, no, we're making so much money off your body. Yeah. Uh... You did the right thing. It takes courage to challenge authority. <laughs> I suppose you would know. Some believe the past is what we make it. But we gain nothing from ignoring mistakes. Wise words. I'm sorry I brought it up. The earthquakes are what matters. I don't know where this lift leads, but... We're about to find out the hard way. Get ready.